207 years ago, the British invaded Louisiana in the Battle of New Orleans. Well, today through cannon and musket fire, students from St. Bernard Parish were transported back in time. Photojournalist Derek Waldrop was there. The guns you see, the cannons you hear, the uniforms that men and women are in, a truly time period accurate. It's living museum material. Today and tomorrow we will be having the, uh, the observance of the 207th anniversary of the American victory in the Battle of New Orleans. We're here to honor our ancestors that fought, died, and or survived in this battle and what it created in the United States. A real true sense of pride and power beating the British forces, which were the greatest army at the time. First off, you do know that the United States declared war on Great Britain in 1812. Okay. Children are learning about Louisiana history and especially the Battle of New Orleans. I feel like I'm going to have nightmares about it. Here's the situation. The plan was for the British to be able to take New Orleans and the mouth of the river and then ultimately divide up the lands and stop the young nation from developing. Miraculously, that did not happen. And in fact, America's launch occurred right here in New Orleans. We feel it's very important to give identity to children. If they don't know their history, they don't have an identity. We want young people to be proud of being a New Orleanian because of the launch of America. And that was Derek Waldrop reporting. The event continues tomorrow at the field next to the Sydney Torres Memorial Park in Chalmette.